Hello students, this is our session 4 of chapter 3 that is data representation. In the previous sessions, we have discussed like how to convert from decimal to other number system. So let's revise how to convert from decimal number system to other number systems. So if we want to convert from decimal to binary, I have to divide it by 2. The given decimal number is divided by 2. If I want to convert from decimal to octal, I have to divide it by 8. If I want to convert from decimal to hexadecimal number system, then I have to divide it by 16. So this is the first step. In the second step, what we have to do? We have to note down the remainder as well as the quotient. In step 3, we have to repeat step 1 and step 2 until we get the quotient as 0. In step 4, we have to mark down the LSB as well as the MSB. The first reminder is called as LSB and the last reminder is called as MSB. Whatever the equivalence R should be written from MSB to LSB. In today's session, we are going to discuss about how to convert from binary to decimal conversion. Binary to decimal conversion. So, what is a binary number system? Binary number system contains only two symbols or digits that is zeros and ones. Hence the base of the system is 2 and the positional values are expressed in terms of 2, in powers of 2. So what is the first step? The first step is multiply each bit of the binary number of the binary number by its positional values by its positional weights. Step 2 is add all the products, add all the products. So first step is we have to multiply each bit of the binary number by its positional weights and second step is we have to add all the products. So let's do some problems based on this conversion. First problem is 1001 base 2. We have to convert it into decimal number system. So what is the first step? The first step is we have to multiply each bit of the binary number by its positional values. So how to do this? First write the binary digits. That is first digit is 1. 1 into 2 plus 0 into 2 plus 0 into 2 plus 1 into 2. Then what we have to do? We have to add the powers. That is from, we have to add the powers from right to left. So, 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 power 2 and 2 power 3. Next, 1 into 2 to the power of 3. What is the value of 2 to the power of 3? That is 2 into 
टू इंटू टू विच इज इक्वल टू एट सो वन इंटू एट प्लस हियर जीरो इंटू टू टू द पावर ऑफ टू सो एनी नंबर इंटू जीरो इज जीरो सो हेन्स द वैल्यू इज जीरो हियर हियर ऑल्सो सेम एनी नंबर इंटू जीरो इज जीरो प्लस टू टू द पावर ऑफ जीरो इज नथिंग बट वन हेन्स वन इंटू वन नाउ एड ऑल द प्रोडक्ट हियर वन इंटू एट इज एट प्लस जीरो प्लस जीरो प्लस वन इंटू वन इज वन सो एट प्लस वन इज नाइन सो वॉट इज द बेस ऑफ दिस नंबर सिस्टम इज टेन वी आर कन्वर्टिंग फ्रॉम बाइनरी टू डेसीमल हेन्स द बेस ऑफ द सिस्टम इज टेन नेक्स्ट प्रॉब्लम second problem 1000111110 base 2 so what is the first step multiply by 2 0 into 2 plus 0 into 2 plus Zero into two plus one into two plus one into two plus one into two plus zero into two. Then you have to add the powers from right to left. So zero, one, two, three, four, five. Six and seven. So now multiply. What is two to the power of seven? Two to the power of seven is nothing but one twenty-eight plus any number into zero is zero plus any number into zero is zero plus any number into zero is zero plus one into two to the power of three. What is two to the power of three? Two to the power of three is eight. So one into eight plus one into two to the power of two. What is two to the power of two? Two into two is four. So one into four. Next, what is one into two to the power of one? Two to the power of one is nothing but two. So one into two plus zero into two to the power of zero. Any number into zero is zero. Now add all the products. So one into one twenty eight is nothing but one twenty eight plus zero zero zero. You just discard this. One into eight is eight plus one into four is Four plus one into two is two. So add all the numbers, which is nothing but one forty-two base ten. Next problem. so these are all simple type problems you can easily score marks in this section third problem is triple 1 0 one, double 1 double 1 base 2 yes One into two plus one into two plus one into two plus 
zero into two plus one into two plus one into two plus one into two plus one into two. Now add the powers. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. What is two to the power of seven? So two to the power of seven. You have to multiply two by seven times. That is two into two into two into two into two two, which is nothing but one twenty eight. So one into one twenty eight plus. So what is two to the power of six? Two to the power of six is. Sixty-four. So one into sixty-four plus one into two to the power of five. What is two to the power of five? Two to the power of five is nothing but thirty-two plus any number into zero is zero plus one into two to the power of three. What is two to the power of three? Two to the power of three is eight. So one into eight plus two to the power of two is four. One into four plus one into two to the power of one is two. So one into two plus one into two to the power of zero. Two to the power of zero means one. So one into one. So now add all the products. What is one into one twenty eight? One twenty eight itself. One into sixty four is. Sixty-four, one into thirty-two is thirty-two, plus one into eight is eight, plus one into four is four, plus one into two is two, plus one into one is one. Now add all the numbers. So what is the value? The value is two thirty-nine. Base ten. The decimal equivalent of one 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 zero one 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 is two thirty nine base ten. Next problem. Problem number four. One one zero one one point one zero one base two. So here we have fractional part also. So for that, what we have to do? First, we have to follow the same procedure. So one into two plus One into two plus zero into two plus one into two plus one into two. So add the powers from right to left. So it is zero, one, two, three, and four. For the fractional parts, one into two. Plus zero into two plus one into two. For this, we have to add the powers from left to right. We have to add the powers from left to right. For this, we have to add the powers from right to left. So one into two is it becomes minus one. It becomes minus two and minus three. So what is two to the power of four? Two to the power of four is sixteen plus one into 
2 to the power of 3 is 8 plus any number into 0 is 0 plus 1 into 2 to the power of 1 is 2 plus 1 into 2 to the power of 0 is 1 that is 1 into 1 plus 1 into what is 2 to the power of minus 1 it is nothing but 1 by 2 it is nothing but 1 by 2 plus any number into 0 is 0 plus 1 into 2 to the power of minus c which is nothing but 1 into 1 by 2 to the power of 3. This is 2 to the power of 1. Next, so multiply 1 into 16 is 16 plus 1 into 8 is 8 plus 0 plus 1 into 2 is 2, 1 into 1 is 1 plus 1 into 1 by 2. What is 1 into 1 by 2 is half. That is 1 into 0 0.5 plus 0 plus 1 by 8. What is the value of 1 by 2 power 3? 2 power 3 is nothing but 8. So, what is the value of 1 by 8? The value of 1 by 8 is 0 0.125. So, hence multiply it by 1, 1 into 0 0.125. Now, add all the numbers that is 16 plus 8 plus 2 plus 1 plus 0 0.5 plus 1 into 0 0.125 is nothing but 0 0.125. The decimal equivalent of 11011.101 is 27.625 base 10. 27.625 base 10. So, how, how to add the values? Which is nothing but 16 plus 8 plus 2 plus 1 plus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.125 which is equal to 27.625. This is how we are going to convert from binary to decimal number system. Thank you.